Welcome, friend, to the championship duel of wits. Well, the take-home version. Budget cuts or something. But, uh, look around, take it all in, and know we've already won. Our allegiance guarantees us both a spot on King Edward's court. How exactly is this going to work? <laughs> Before we get to the rules, I offer a toast and an opportunity. You see, while this game might stretch the imagination, for some I find it rather simple and in need of an additional mental challenge. Guards, the raisin juice, please. <laughs> this is my favorite game, though it's been a long time since I last played it. Are you familiar with hypnotic powder? One sip of this, and you'll have to do everything I say. And, of course, vice versa. In goes the powder. Guard number two, if you would. Hmm, I'll take this one. Whoa, looks like you got the winner. And now we play. So, the goal of the Duel of Wits is to hit your opponent's pawn with an arrow by moving these pieces around the board. Your pawn will fire an arrow after you move. I'll go first. After I move this shield, watch how the arrow bounces off the shields and around the board. Now it's your turn, Graham. <laughs> Not to sound like a royal guard, but as an additional rule, you can't move a shield your opponent moved on his previous turn. Will you please move the lower left shield to your left? I'm so happy we'll be working in the castle together, Graham. And if I ever become king, you'll make an excellent advisor. I'll move this shield, and they'll all have to accept it's what's on the inside that counts. Addendum. <laughs> you can move and rotate your pawn to change the direction you shoot. Will you please rotate your pawn clockwise? Your arrow will always fire in the direction you're facing. I do hope you realize all the planning I did to get us here. I'll just rotate this shield. Well, looks like the hypnosis powder is wearing off. Make any move you want. Not that it matters. Looks like my intelligence has reigned supreme. Guards! Guards! I've won! Please review the winning board. We have to do something. Graham is about to lose. Seriously? You all know I won. Apologies, sir, but Decree 3214 specifically states that all dual victories must be witnessed and verbally notarized by a royal guard, such that it can be recorded for posterity in our tournament record. Unfortunately, the board was compromised before a final notary could be given. Therefore, this victory is nullified, and another game must be played. We really are sorry, and assure you will be able to achieve victory once again. You are the most ridiculous. Ridiculous guards I've ever encountered. No matter. Merely a delay in my ascent to knighthood. I'm ready to beat you again whenever you're ready.
Perhaps you could find a way to track the cup. Sit down. Let's begin. Back so soon? Raisin juice! <laughs> this all seems so familiar. Hypnotic powder. Mix them up. And now, you choose. Hmm. I'll take this one. Oh, excellent choice! And that was the last of my hypnotic powder. And now, we play. I wish I had other powders to make this game more interesting. I've seen enough magic powders for one day. Close, but no! Can you believe what that brute was hiding in his belly? What a disappointment. Well, I am um, actually liked his art. I'm not proud of embarrassing him. <laughs> Graham, that dope will never accept us. He should keep to the knitting. Whisper, though, eh? <laughs> Finally got a taste of his own medicine. He's not that bad once you get to know him. Are you getting soft on me, Graham? Do you have any other secret alliances I should know about? Well, well, well. You can't catch me that easily! Did you think I wouldn't notice that?
Heard you had a run-in with some goblins. I did. Nasty creatures, really. Ugh. But, uh, be careful around them. They're smarter than they look. You left yourself open there, Graham. How does, uh, royal assistant to the king sound, Graham? A victory again! Notary, please! Decree 3214? Afraid so, sir. Unbelievable. Silly addendums. Ready to try again? We'll be watching from here. Ah, I got the best view in the house. Are you sure you're ready to play again? Yes. I'm not afraid. Let's begin. This is getting absurd. How many times do I have to beat you? Shame about Achaka, though. I can't focus on this game. I keep thinking about him. Well, once we're in the castle, we can make sure his people, the Pitstrians, get the surplus they need. It's the least we can do. I saw that. Did you visit that magic shop in town? I did. The Hobblepots have minds of their own. Yes, well, I just wish they'd get serious about the potential of their wares. That didn't really help you. I wonder how soft the beds are in the castle. A victory again! Notary, please! Decree 3214? Afraid so, sir. Unbelievable. Another, you say? Hey, what do you say we make things even more interesting? I like the sound of that. Bring those cups back out here. But only two of them. Okay. Guards! Now, squeeze the last of the hypnotic powder in one. I like where your head is at. Guards, if you would mix, please. Now, I choose. And now you choose. Uh-oh.
Move away from me. Sounds good. Turn clockwise. Sounds good. I think the powder is wearing off. So you used hypnosis on Manny? You didn't try to beat him straight? There is no shame in cheating a cheater. I am ready for decree 3214.6 and a half. Actually, I think it was decree 1.21. Aha! We knew you could do it. You're out of the alliance. I can't lose to you. H how about another challenge? We only got to square off in a duel of wits. A well-rounded gentleman would win in a duel of strength as well. Graham, take this. Pick these, oh, baby. Choose these, baby. Choose these. Uh, uh, uh. Um, challenge. Uh, uh, how would you fare in a duel of speed? No, Manny. It's over. Just as the battle isn't always claimed by the strong, and the race isn't always won by the swift, sometimes the intelligent falter. And I think now is my chance. And now is my time. Come on, Graham. One more duel for Achaka. Do it for the village of starving uh, Pitchthreans. Oh, you said his village was home to the itch twins. What exactly is your plan here? Cause I'm Duel starting to- Duel of speed! No, Graham, he's not worth it. <laughs> 